largest amount of money that I've won on any one winning was my fifth grand prize. It was uh, the game Mega Money here in Florida, and I won over $840,000. I was good in math in school, but I didn't study any specific math courses because my method has nothing to do with any kind of a big math solution that some people might think. The first and most important thing above everything is set a budget. This is extremely important. It is, ex it is very easy to get what's called lottery fever. Do not spend grocery money. Do not spend rent money. Figure out what you can afford, what your budget is, and stay within your budget. So let's just say, we're going to say your budget's $100. Now this will work, I don't care if you only got a $10 budget, okay? But let's just say for this example it's $100. So that means you're going to take that $100. What you do is you divide your budget by 10. So if your budget's only $10, you're going to buy $1 tickets. If your budget's $100, you're going to buy $10 tickets. You buy 10 tickets in a row of the same game. Do not spread it out over three or four different games. If you buy 10 tickets in a row of the same game, almost every single time you do that, you're going to find a winning ticket in there. Most of the times, even two winning tickets, and sometimes even three or four winning tickets in that stretch of ten tickets in a row. You just increased your chances of winning. Number two, it is very common that people will go up to the counter to buy lottery tickets, and they'll hand the clerk a couple of dollars, and they'll say, give me a couple of tickets for tonight's drawing. That's what's called a quick pick. Folks, do not buy quick picks. What do you mean don't buy quick picks? I always buy quick picks. Have you won? That's the secret. You never increase your chances when you're buying quick picks. They're always the same. So don't buy quick picks. And then the third thing is, people say, well, does your lottery work like with scratch tickets? Because I don't really buy the other games, but I, I play scratch tickets. Absolutely it does. I see people do this all the time. They go up to the counter and they say, hmm, let me see here. Well, let me have a couple of those. And, Ooh, you got bingo. I like bingo. Let me have a few of those. And Hey, I like the colors on that ticket right there. Let me have a couple of those. Again, folks, worst thing you could do. You might as well put on a blindfold, take a loaded gun, and try to hit the target. It's not going to happen. One of the biggest things that I stress among setting up a budget and so forth and so on is, folks, luck has nothing to do with this. But am I a lucky guy by nature all through my life? No. I don't believe so. I believe most of the good things that have happened to me have been because I was methodical, I thought it through, and approached it in a manner that I felt gave me the best chance.